Coming to you from the MMA 30 studios in Las Vegas, my name's Dave Farrop. It's time for another two-minute update. This one is brought to us by our friends at The Debt Specialist. If you're looking to restructure $15,000 or more in credit card debt, why don't you call them today at 877-826-4007. Martin Campman is a UFC fighter who was recently sidelined right before a big fight with Ben Saunders at UFC 111. And that's certainly one of the most frustrating things that can happen to any fighter. He was preparing for his fight when he got cut bad right over his eye at his practice at Extreme Couture in Las Vegas. Here Martin Campman explains what happened. I shot into a kick. The other guy was kicking. I shot in. I hit his knee. So just bad timing, you know. I hope to get a new fight in May. You know, I'll, I just want to get right back in there. I don't want to wait. At UFC 109 in the co-main event, Chael Sonnen shocked the world by beating Nate Marquardt. Many people expected Nate to win that fight, including Nate himself. He said, although he lost, he's ready to fine-tune his training and get back to the gym and figure out who his next opponent will be so he can simply move on. You know, I'm going to fine-tune my training, figure out uh, everything that I did wrong and fix my mistake, and I'll be back stronger and, and smarter for, for it. Is that the hardest part, is waiting after, whether it's a win or a loss, to find out what's next? Yeah, definitely after a loss. I mean, uh, you, you want to get right back in there and kind of redeem yourself. Many people consider one of the best fights of 2009 to be the WEC's Ben Henderson versus Donald Cowboy Cerrone. Well, on April the 24th, we're going to get to see the rematch in the WEC's debut on pay-per-view. And this time, Donald said, he's going to change things up to make sure he walks away with the victory. Your next fight, you're fighting what, well, a lot of people said it was the fight of the year in 2009. You and Ben Henderson, the rematch is happening. Absolutely, yeah, it's going to be fight of the year again, man. I think, uh, you know, he's, he, he's ready to bring it, and I'm, I'm coming to the table with, with a lot more to offer this time, so I think I'm going to walk away with the title. To check out the latest fighter videos, link up with us on Twitter, and check out our daily podcast, log on to MMA30.com. From the MMA30 studios in Las Vegas, I'm Dave Farah. Thanks for watching.